Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's me, your friend David, here. I'm going to be playing this Bayonetta. I love this. I'm playing it on the Wii U. I love this game. I love Platinum. Alright. Yes. Let's go with normal. Alright, so this game. Okay, so. Yeah, you can move around the this around for some reason. Uh, very easy, especially if you don't uh, know what you're getting yourself into. If you're not familiar with these types of games, I, I've heard them called, being called uh, character action games. I, like, but anyway, this game will kick your ass if you're not careful. Here we go. This game has awesome music. It's like one of the one of the many things about it. The right. Oh shit. Long since erased from the records of time, there once existed two European clans who served as overseers. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! The umbral. Yeah, you can hear somebody talking right there. The and the Lumen Sages, controllers of the light. What? The clans paid each other great Boom. respect, Boom. and their efforts Damn. to maintain the balance between Wait, them and defend ah. the just passage of time. Yeah, so he's just talking about, uh, origins, like, a bunch of stuff that's... Uh, there's two, two clans, the Umbra Witches, the Lumen Sages, there. They used to be they used to be cool. They used to be friends, but then everything just kind of went to shit. So the once harmonious clans fell into disagreement. Oh, yeah, there we go. Then stoked the flames of hatred against and each other, boom. resulting in an era of strife. Yeah, 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 the yeah. Between the yeah. and the Luma threw all of Europe into a chaotic boom. Ow. battle, ambush, assassination, and casualty. Yeah, it was true. Some war. Oh, yeah, the war's, is war's fucking hell. Shining upon them, the Lumen Sages were gradually weakened. All right, I don't have that shit. The secretive dark witches. I'm so used to having all of my powers and abilities. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Yeah, the um, the Umbral Witches won the war apparently. Uh, yeah, spoilers, witches are badasses. And boom, 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 this game, you can get really easily distracted in this game. Humans began to condemn. Like there's so many details about these games. Rounding up the battle weary witches with the That don't need to be there, but they're there anyway, so. Human faith in the mirror. Just for you to enjoy. Push the witch hunts further. Oh shit, he's there. The umbra witches. Looked away for a second. Oh, I don't have the jump kick thing. I forget what it's called. Punch, 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 Oh shit, that's not good. That looks like a fucking Dragon Ball Z attack. Yeah. Look at these badass chicks. Okay, so, fun fact. Um, when the creators of Bayonetta, specifically... The woman, yes, the woman who designed the character Bayonetta, uh, found out that they're found out about the po the porn, but all the porn that fans drew based on this on this series. Uh, the only thing she was upset by was the fact that m more often than not, Bayonetta was submissive in the in that porn. So. But when, but when Bayonetta started being more dominant in porn, she was happy. She was fine with it. So, yeah. 
I re I read that on the TV tropes in intro, uh, not intro, in page for Bayonetta. Yes, I'm a pervert though, but I am a pervert, I'll admit. Everyone's a pervert. These guys are stabbing themselves. It's not 100% clear why. Maybe it was to summon these freak-ass angel monsters. Yes, for those of you who don't know, you're a witch in this game and you fight angels. So there is some mild sacrilegious shit going on. Ah. Yes. Yes, I know. Submenu. Yeah, fascinating. Uh, I'm not gonna save yet. Start. And loading screen. Uh, lo eventually we'll get, get the loading screens in which, uh, get to run around as been, uh, just practice combos and stuff with different weapons that you bring into the loading screen with you. So, yeah. Yeah, Team Little Angels. Ah, oh, the Seal of Quality. Established 2006. I, lo I love this. I love that they just have all these, just, I love, I love having, like, uh, uh, what, these things, these words in, like, credits that are in the world. Oh no. That, that, hmm. It looks like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. And here we're introduced to one of the Even most... Man, the destroyer gets one of the, the most racist right? characters I've ever seen in my life. Well, I still don't get why the hell you dragged me out here for these things. Take a wild I guess why. Hey, that you can't guess... To any Italians in the audience, I apologize hey, because Enzo... Wow, which is wow. People have been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. But at least he's not just talking about. At least he's not talking about how much he loves spaghetti. At least his name isn't Pizza Pasta. God, God damn it, Arcade Punch Out. Pizza Pasta! I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. Yeah, I'm pretty sure a lot of people do. It's that kind of town. Without good-hearted souls like us that put these bastards <coughs> six feet under, where'd society be? Good-hearted souls. <laughs> the not bad either. Yeah, there it is. Jesus, you really get into this shit, don't you? He curses me, more than I do. I'd be praying he ends up barbecue. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> He's got jokes. He's got jokes. Not very good ones. You can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> Speaking of hungry, we done here. Not My yet. kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. How many dads in the world call their kids cute little fuckers? Uh, oh, what's this? What the fuck? They're here for this douchebag? Ah, I hate this damn light. I can't see a thing. Uh oh. Why do you care now? You were just pissing on somebody's grave. You were just pissing on Hideki Kamiya's grave. They are instruments of God. Uh, Hideki Kamiya, that's a guy I would love to hang out with. I would love to just just sit with him at a cafe or something and just, just hang out with the guy. Yeah. Uh, Kamiya, he worked on a lot of really great games. Like, he did Resident Evil 2, uh, Okami, Beautiful Joe, Devil May Cry, this. And one of my favorite games of all time, The Wonderful 101. Oh my god. I love that guy. I just want to hang out with him all the time. And I was just like, what the fuck is going on? Why am I even here? 
Why do I have to be here for this? No. Here we go, first enemy. Third Spear Angel's Affinity. Alright. Boom! 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 <laughs> yeah. I'm betting people who first played this might not have seen that coming. Probably not. Maybe not? I don't know. You're tired. Let me tuck you in. Just a, a girl, a woman dressed as a nun, just kicking the shit out of me. <laughs> Giant swing! <laughs> Yeah, it's your birthday, but it's not a- that doesn't mean it has to be a good day. Why are you praying now? Why are you praying now, man? Uh, oh, yes, this guy. He's the coolest part of this game. Look at him. <laughs> Next time you want me hands. Oh, such a good shot. And he doesn't care. That fucking grave lid thing just fucking coffin lid just fell on his head and he didn't even flinch. He didn't even flinch. That's awesome. How about you get out of here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you want. Yeah. Rod Rodan is so cool. Do you naughty little angels deserve a good spanking? Yeah. Ugh. Was that Hideki Kamiya's grave, I guess? I think I saw his name on that grave. Uh, uh, here we go. Here we go. Don't watch, kids. Here it goes. Bayonetta. <laughs> there's the titular character, Bayonetta. Uh, this game is so fucking cool. Ah, uh, yes. He just backhands that angel. Don't worry about quality. I've got quantity. He's just tossing a bunch of handguns at her. He's like, you know, if we let her get a gun. How is she shooting the guns on her heels? Like, I know the... I know the typical excuse would be just magic, but... How? Legit how? Do girls just have extra fingers on their feet? That just, they can just do that? Like, what? <laughs> uh... Like, yeah, lollipop. All right. Yeah, bang that I love their lollipop. That sounds wrong. Uh, there's a beautiful Joe reference right there. I think. I think I just saw a grave that said Joe. Just Joe. That was your last call. No more shots from me, Bayonetta. This cutscene is so long. I love it. Alright. Here we go. Ah. Oh. Tutorial shit that I don't need because I already know how to play the game. I don't care about touch control. Oh, there we go. Okay, yes. Tutorials. 
Boom, boom, boom. Oh my god! Tutorials. These are a currency in this world for some reason. And boom! And don't worry, ladies and gentlemen, I will get more, more uh, weapons and stuff, so I'm not just stuck with dumb handguns and basic attacks. I really want the fucking jump kick thing. And boom! A lot of the stuff in this game is super, the stuff that you buy in this game is super expensive, so you need cash. Alright. Ah, oh, jeez, these things. It's best to do. Excuse me. You. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, you can just do this. Just mash the button. Of course, you can just press Y to shoot, so... Gonna grab these halos. Boom. Dead. And boom! Halos, halos, halos. Alright, grab this stuff. Yeah! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! Alright, so... I'm so sorry I'm not talking, but these games require a lot of concentration. There we go. What's Enzo up to? Up oh, on the big guy. I'm pretty sure he can if he wants to. I don't think there are regulations to mur to possible murder. If for some reason you have to double jump, I I don't think I've ever encountered an area in which I needed to double jump. That's the only time where she looks... That's the only time in the entire series where she looks remotely flustered. Like, oop, did, did I did I fuck up? Did I just... Yeah, I think I fucked up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. She's talking to the angels, I guess. What? Bum Like, kick. 
I think I have infinite health. But health? Health? What's health? Health. Health. Talking is hard. Ow. Talking is hard. Uh, people don't like that attack, but I do. It looks really cool to me. Boom. Boom. What the hell was that? That noise I... What, what noise did I just make? What is that? Yeah. Boom. 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 I want to grab their halos. No. Uh, okay. Silver metal. Yeah, I don't have to do. Redon should be paying me for even touching these toys. Yeah. Do you have any idea how much this is going to cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? <laughs> Why am I laughing? Ed and Edna. Those are Enzo's kids, I believe. Now. About this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. See? This is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things, and you wanted to... Brilliant writing. It never stops with you. One thing about uh, Platinum that's kind of not great is their storytelling. Like, sometimes it's just weird and makes no sense. But as we go, you'll probably see what I mean. Before this shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about Eggman? Such a pop. Don't worry, Sonic the Hedgehog will take care of him. Down there as much as you did when he was up here. Sonic the Hedgehog will always kick Eggman's ass, even though Sonic is dead. Except for Sonic Boom. Sonic Boom cartoon. I mean, is. The, cart the Sonic Boom cartoon isn't actually all that bad. I mean, it's nothing like... It's not uh, re anything revolutionary, but it's not bad. What? Don't you leave me here! Alright, so, yeah. You can press the minus button in the Wii U version to go into uh, practice mode. Just... Yeah, just practice your combos. So that's cool. I'm probably not gonna do that though. So I don't want to waste you guys' time. Oh, what a day! I'm screwed. Ah, it's gonna. This song, the song is playing right now on the radio. I'm guessing. It sounds like something out of Sonic. See them bastards that did this to my car? Forget about it. Enzo, the road. Yeah, pay attention to the road, dumbass. How can you be so calm? You're still getting screwed in all this too. I don't like Bayonetta's hair. I don't like Bayonetta's hair in this game. Her hairstyle, rather, because I don't like beehive look. It just looks kind of weird to me. That's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfit. Yeah, her day job when she's not murdering angels, she's a nun. Because she likes cosplaying as a nun. Oh, there goes uh, the the what what is that called the, the thing that goes on the wheel? Hubcap. Hubcap. That's what it's called. The hubcap. There goes the hubcap. It rolled off. But being forced to slap around the divine for a living, it's really getting screwed. Yeah, so Bayonetta has to kill angels just to survive, I guess. I see to the funeral. Um. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Hold on, guys. I'll be back in a second. I'm back. Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! My grandmother needed my help with something. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pad and figuring out some of that lost past. Yeah, so Bayonetta has amnesia. That's a thing. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash, just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus! Can't you take a joke? Enzo, someone's given you a present. Too bad. I can't stand 
bugs. <laughs> I got it. That's a joke. She doesn't like real bugs and she doesn't like... Uh... She doesn't like spies. Yep, yeah, I guess that's the word I'm looking for there. What the fuck? That's the appropriate reaction to seeing an airplane. Oh, the these cutscenes. Yeah. So. Yeah, these uh, still motion, still motion, I guess they'd be called. These are those are one of the not good parts about this game. One of the few not good things about this game. Whoa. What? Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Some shit's going on over there. Oh! Red suited white lady. people in this game, except for Rodan, are British, for some reason. Well, I guess they're Umber Witches, they're from Europe, I guess. The English accent. So you don't have to fight Red Suit Lady, you just have to kill a bunch of angels with different attacks. And then, boom. You have to charge up you have to kill them with torture attacks, which you'll see an example of shortly. Boom. And there's one for you, an Iron Maiden. Um, yeah! I keep forgetting I don't have the, the uh, jump kick thing. I don't have the jump kick. I gotta remind myself about that. God damn it. Why, why do I keep trying to do something I don't know how to do? And in you go. Yeah, if you mash hard enough, you can get uh, more... Like, the harder you mash, the more halos you get as a reward for finishing an enemy off with, uh, uh, torture attacks. And you get different kinds of torture attacks depending on how you, depending on where you come, with, come from with it. Like, if you come from behind, you get, get like, some kind of guillotine? Ah, here it is! Speak of, speak of the devil! Yeah! And boom! Decapitation! Gold! The gold has Rodan. Boom, 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 gunshot. You think angels would bleed like a different color, but eh, whatever. No big deal. Bang, bang. <laughs> they're, just act they're actively posing as they murder. And mysterious red suit lady is gone. The mysterious communist. She just flies off. Platinum coffee! If I was ever to drink coffee, I would drink platinum coffee. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. I got- I love how Platinum just references themselves like that. Like, if you look closely at uh, Enzo's car in some scenes, you can see a little PM on the side. Which more than likely stands for, like, Platinum Machine or Platinum Motors or something like that. Like, I'm guessing in this world, Platinum has, like, some kind of 
mon monopoly on everything. <laughs> That's the kind of world I would want to live in, actually. Those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down at home. Eh, hotheads. I get it. Because hell. It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Right, so those are the three realms of this world. Purgatorio is sort of like a parallel version of Earth. Where you can fight without being interrupted by humans and shit. Uh, Paradiso is heaven. Inferno is hell. I guess that's obvious. The Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. That's bad. Gonna go I never noticed he has like some kind of tattoo under his nose that looks like a mustache. Rodon, other than Mike Tyson, Rodon is the only guy in the, in the fucking world I could possibly see as pulling off that facial tattoo he's got. Like Mike, Mike Tyson pulls it off. Rodon pulls it off. I can't think of anyone else who could possibly pull off a, a face tattoo like that. So yeah, Rodon is also the guy who supplies you with all your weapons and stuff. These babies are special. Uh. Built from an alloy, the devil himself would kill the You mean you? Aren't you the devil? Because they're one of a kind. Okay, so spoiler alert. Uh, Rodon actually is like a fallen angel. And... Now, he's giving us this, these four guns called the Scarborough Fair. <laughs> I love this. This is so stupidly over the top, I love it. Bayonetta is astoundingly coordinated. And that whole time, Rodan was just preparing a drink for her. Little... What, what would that be? Like, some kind of martini or something? Then again, I'm getting a little tired hmm. of these weaklings they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more... high class. Oh my god, that line makes me think she's like some kind of James Bond villain. <laughs> or maybe she is like female James Bond. She's over the top enough to fill the role. <laughs> the guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. Oh my. Yes. Thank you. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. <laughs> So, the person who just interrupted just now was my grandmother. Yeah, she was dropping something off in my room for me. Used no item. I'm proud of that. This game punishes you for using items. So, yeah. Don't use items unless you're really, really desperate. Alright. Do, do, do. Oh, this, this. This is a way you can get extra halos. You can find little bullet things in the game. Yeah, okay, yes. Okay. Ah, shit. And you wanna hit the big guys over there. And, ah, ah. Well, I got 41 points. This is a way you can earn extra halos or get some items like like the red hot shot you want the red hot shot because it gives it uh, revives you when you die it doesn't revive you at full health fair warning but it does revive you all right I'm just gonna take the halos yep and there's your map this is your chapter select menu 
All right. All right, Angel's Metropolis. I'm done. I'm done here. So, Bayonetta. This is an awesome game. If you haven't played it yet, I highly recommend that you do. I'm gonna be playing all the way through it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this.